Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello and welcome back to the channel. I have a PayPal Patty double feature. Try saying that three times fast. In this first encounter, we have PayPal Patty in one corner and a rather angry cop in the other. Angry only because PayPal Patty made him that way. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Hey, what's up, guys? Hello there. News Now Patrick here. We are live. We're here at the Walmart parking lot on uh, Sawdust. No, this is Rayford. 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 Rayford Sawdust area. And uh, we got two constables over here. Well, he's gonna put the light on us. How's it going? What are you putting the light on me for? Can I help you? What's that? Okay, why did you see you in this other unit over here talking? What's going on? We're talking on a civil service call. Okay. Totally okay, well, I'm in the car. I was on the phone, and you started lighting me up. So what's going on? Okay, because you're pointing the light at me. So can you tell your office, your constable over here not to block me in? He's not blocking you. We don't block. Okay, well, what's up with his lights? Tell him to turn his lights off, man. Because you've got a light in our face. Well, who put it on me first, so sir? If we're talking on the call, and a car pulls up right next to us with all these other available parking spots, it makes us suspicious, okay? Okay. Cops get shot all the time. Okay. A am I a threat to you? No. I, I mean, I don't know. Is there a reason that you're out of your car and addressing him right now? Me and your sergeant are having a conversation. Why are you walking up to me with an attitude? I swear every time I see this little punk, he always has a nasty attitude toward cops or women. Because it's odd for somebody to pull up to two cops in a parking lot and start recording them for absolutely no hey, reason. Hey, 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 I'm having a conversation with your sergeant, okay? Well, looks like you're having a conversation with me right now. Well, that's because you approached me. That's fine. That's fine. No, I'm, you're, you can talk to me. You're good. I'm talking to the sergeant. Yeah. What's up, man? You got a problem? I do. With what? I'm talking to your sergeant. Chill. Chill out. Chill out. I don't want to talk to you, man. Chill. Okay, then don't talk God. to me. Yeah, just talk. Because, like I said... He and I are on a civil service call out of precinct two right now. What okay, that's cool. I, I didn't need any help. I only want, I got out of the car because you you put your light on. I put mine on you on you. I got you. And then he did the same thing to me. So what's up, man? Talk, hey, you gotta address me. What's your name? Me. What's your badge number? You don't worry about my badge number. Talk to. No, 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 no. It's not. Don't worry about it. What's your badge number? Hey, all right. Listen, listen. Are, are we done? Do you need anything else? What you me? stepping on me for, man? You think I won't put a complaint in on you? Look at you and Go turn your ahead. body cam on. Turn it on. I'm on a different call right now. My body cam's rolling. See the red light? Okay, I see it, yeah. but I don't see it on his. It it's fine. Okay? Yeah. I, so, <laughs> you guys addressed me, so what, what's the deal? I've already explained to you why we addressed you. Okay, well, wait, what is, what's, what's up with his aggression here? This is, he's not being aggressive. <laughs> he's not being aggressive? Okay, okay, Sergeant. Are you the only Sergeant on duty tonight? Am, yes, sir. Okay, that's the problem. So, why is it a problem? It is what it is. Do you guys need anything from me? Are you good? Yeah, Princess. Why is it a problem that there's only one sergeant on duty tonight? No, you you came up to us. After you put it, the goddamn light on me. I'm in the car. I'm on the... light. Look at all these parking spots, okay? Okay. I don't want to get shot. My deputy doesn't want to get shot. So whenever you position your vehicle right up next to two police officers... Okay, and then I see a light come toward me. That makes us suspicious. Okay, who, we can who, always come down from it just like we're talking now. Okay, who put sense. a light on who first? You put the, I saw whatever that, I guess it was your camera light. Okay. There's no light on my camera. It's a phone. You you turned on your overheads. I don't have, it's an iPhone. It's got a light on. I've got okay, too. you turned your, your overheads on, and I said, what the hell is this guy doing? So then I I pulled out my flashlight, and I went like this. It doesn't matter. We, we can be in front of a police station. Okay. You park to me, and I see a lot of movement when there's other, other parking spots. I'm gonna put my takedowns on you. Okay, okay, cool. My car's not bulletproof. My glass oh. is not bulletproof. Okay, and I stepped out of the vehicle. Do I have any weapons on me? I have no idea. I haven't patted you down. Well, I don't want to be patted down. I don't have any weapons okay. on me. Okay. Have a good day. You too.
Hey, you shouldn't put your back to somebody when they're walking behind you. Oh, man, you just keep on driving that knife deeper and deeper. If this wasn't a cop and he had turned your back on you and you said that, you would be on the pavement right now. You want to come walk up behind me? <laughs> look at this. Hey, Sergeant, look at this. Why don't you get back in your car? <laughs> look at this. Look at this. What are you doing, dude? You're going to come walk up behind me? No, and I... talk shit about walking up behind me? What's up with the Why language? Why don't you get in your car and go back to whatever fucking rock you crawled out from under? Hey, Sergeant, do you see this? Yeah, get back in your car, okay? Do you see this? You're going to follow me to my vehicle and talk shit about walking up behind me? I, I just said don't let people walk behind you, that's it. Why are you walking up behind me it's to a, begin with? Don't, don't, don't let anyone get a tactical advantage on you. You don't need to be sitting here saying the F word, saying shit, so listen, vulgar you're, language. Yeah, you're exactly right in what you said, tactical advantage. I appreciate you. I'm just letting right. him know. That's exactly why we're doing what you we're should, doing. You should you're a hothead. You shouldn't be law enforcement, brother. You should not. Look how you're acting. Uh -huh. Throwing F-bombs on me for what? You got a problem, dude. That's why he's a sergeant and you're not. So. Damn, what's his problem? He's having a bad night. <laughs> no, he's having a great night. It doesn't seem like he is it. He's very tactically sound. Oh, but but he's but he's tactically sound. But I'm walking. So. Look! Look at this guy! Look at this guy! <laughs> what? What is this guy's? Hey, Sergeant. Seriously, I'm gonna get out of here, but I don't want him. I don't want him fucking with me. So I'm gonna. Well, I had to cut it off right there because for the next ten minutes, all he does is whine and complain about the incident that he instigated. So I didn't want to subject you to any of that because I am sure most of you hate his annoying crybaby voice. It drives me up the wall. That's for sure. Okay, up next we have him at a Walmart as he refuses to show his receipt. So what are you stopping me today for? I asked to see your receipt for electronics. Michelle, can I get you up at the gym or anything? Okay, but didn't I tell you you can ask the guys in the back if I, I hadn't made the purchase? Anybody, didn't I present you didn't I present you a receipt? Just now. What's your name? My name is Tammy. And you work here? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Do you see the receipt? Are you gonna continue to stop me? I worked for Walmart for 10 years, five years in TLE selling tires, five years in maintenance as I was going to college. And I can damn well tell you, boy, you better show your receipt and have that TV on there or you're going to be sitting in the 100 room while the cops show up for you. Every time you try to go out the door with an electronics, I will. Okay, yes, I, and I, I told you I had a receipt. receipt. So what's the deal? The deal is this, boy. You either show that receipt with the TV on it, or you end up in the 100 room waiting for the cops. And yes, people do walk through the doors all the time with those TVs with no receipts to show whatsoever and manage to get away with it. I've even seen, when I worked in TLE, people come through the emergency exit door, throw the TV in the back of their truck, and r drive off while managers are chasing them. We are supposed to see the receipt. Okay, well, are you detaining me? No, sir, I asked you okay, to see a you, receipt. Do you see it? Yes, I see Can you I now. leave? Thank you. Can I leave? Absolutely, okay. sir. When is Walmart going to learn? Why are you doing this? <laughs> I, I told you I had a receipt. I presented a receipt. Okay, and I'm going to tell her that you're stopping me for nothing. Why are you That's doing my this? Job. It's my job, sir. Come hey, on. Thank you. Where, is she still coming? Oh, yeah, she's coming. Okay. I'll talk to your boss. I came here to purchase a goddamn TV. No, 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 no. Are you the manager here? Yes, I am. This lady, she has been very Hello. uncooperative, very rude, disrespectful to me. So I come out. I'm, I, I just came here to get some TVs. She asked me if I had a receipt. She said, do you have a receipt? I said, yes, I have a receipt. I said, here's my receipt. And then I proceeded to leave. And then she tries to stop me from leaving the store. I followed she, him out here. She wouldn't to see the receipt. She wouldn't let me go. And I said, you know what? If, you, no think I, if I, you think I stole this, ask the people in electronics. I come here all the time. I'm a paying customer. I spend a lot of money here. All right, and so I have you a put your phone down. No, 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 no. I, I don't want to be taped. Okay, but listen, this has been.
Michelle, this has been an issue. Hey, why are you stepping on me? I'm not. I'm, I'm, I'm I step. Up. Look, I'm gonna step back, and then you're gonna step forward, like you did just well, now. You, I didn't even move. Look, this has been an I issue. I didn't even move. This has been an issue with Walmart for a long time. We have the right to ask for a receipt. Okay, but you do not have the right to do what this lady did and stop me. She has the right to ask you for the receipt. Okay, and and I provided it, and then it's this is still going. Provided it after. I, no, 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 I told you inside, lady. You told me you did not provide me the receipt. I said, I have a receipt, and I went like this. Like I can see that. It's a receipt. It could be a receipt for a candy bar. Sorry. What is this, stop and, 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 and pat me down and search me for a receipt? Come on. Come on. I came in here to get a TV. Ask them in electronics. They have radios. We, no, they don't. They do not. So they can't be like, okay. They do not have a they radio. You have a radio. She's got a radio. Why okay. don't they? Well, they maybe don't you should. Get, maybe your employees should have a radio. <laughs> no, that's not. How maybe I'm maybe you should give them all radios. And who's going to pay for that buttercup? You. These stores have to work within a certain budget in order to make money. So equipment like radios are only given to those who really need them, such as the uh, salaried managers, hourly managers, and maintenance. And more often than not, I was the member of maintenance that had the radio. So, you provided the receipt. If it's if your stuff is on there, you need to leave. Did you property. ask this guy to come out here? No, I did not. I'm actually coming to break time. Oh, okay, okay. No, no, everything's good, man. Uh, just a miscommunication here. This lady, this lady here thought I was stealing. I got a receipt here. Nobody said you were stealing. Nothing came out of their mouth of being accused of stealing. Am I free to leave? You were told that a second ago. Well, I know, but she said you were coming. So, can I leave? You were told you that a second ago by me if you would have listened. Okay. All right, I'm going to go ahead and leave. Have a nice day. Damn. Judging by the TLE gray shirt, he's either a shop foreman or he's the support manager for TLE. Either way, Princess Patty Cake doesn't seem to want to mess with him, so he just walks away after this encounter.